Hi, my name is Elizabeth Wakefield and I'm going to do my special occasion speech. For my speech, I'm going to talk about what I said at my papa's funeral. My papa was the best person that you've ever met. He taught me how to fish, he taught me how to drive the tractors, he taught me everything. He taught me how to swim when I was little because we grew I grew up on boats. So we'd always go to the lake together and we would do everything together. He lived right next to me, so every every day I saw him. He owned his own stained glass business too in East Bend called Salem Stained Glass. He was amazing. He started from nothing and made it into putting making a window for the Pope. And they went to we all went to Rome and we put the window in together. Every year since I was in kindergarten, we'd make a stained glass apple and I'd give it to my teachers. He did this for my mom and her brother too. The tradition almost lived on with my cousins if he hadn't passed away in January. He was everything to me. His business is still going strong in East Bend. He has windows all over the country. When I was a little girl, I used to play school. So I'd come go to my grandma's house, I'd have a room to myself, I'd have a whiteboard, I even had an overhead. So everything I did, I taught him school, I, I played teacher, I would go to my grandma's house and dress up just like my teachers did. I would do everything. I graded papers, I made him sit through hours of hours of play school when he got back from work. We also would go play outside. He even let me paint his nails one day. And the day, the night before I painted his nails, he didn't take it off. And then he went to get a massage the next day. And he still had the toe nail polish on. So he went to get a massage with purple toes. This big, strong man had purple toes when he went to get a massage. He was everything. Sorry if I get emotional, but. The whole world changed on Jan in January of last year when he, or the beginning of this year, when he passed away. Nothing has ever been the same. And just this morning, I lost my other grandpa. So that's what I talked about in my last, in my um, other speech that I did. I talked about how I lost all my grandparents and how I've survived that through anxiety, depression, but. He was everything to me, and I said in my speech at his funeral, and I think of him daily, and I just love him so much. So thank you.